All right, you guys, so we are off to Walmart. I decided to go ahead and bring the kiddos with me and hope that this trip is good. Hopefully I can get enough good clips. So yeah, but right now we are going to Walmart. I'm going down my long dirt road. It's super bumpy, but they did fix it a little bit, so that's nice. Anyway, here we go. Hey y'all, so real quick, I wanted to show you my grocery list for the week. I want to explain kind of what I do when I write out my grocery list. So real fast, the first thing I always do um, is I start off with must-have items. I start those right here, things that are on the top of my head that I know we must get. So I write those first, and then everything else you can see is by aisle. We have like our snack aisle, the milk aisle, and you know all of these are by aisles. It's so much easier when I separate my list like that. That way when I'm shopping, I can just go through each aisle one time. I'm not jumping all around the store. Um, it also gets me out of the store faster. So like when I go, I know exactly what I'm getting on each aisle. I'm not, you know, slowly walking down each aisle seeing more items that I might want. It keeps me from overspending. Um, after I write out my list, I always go through and estimate how much these items will cost individually. And then I add it all up at the end. It's okay. It's okay. That's all right. We just had one of those. I live close to a military base, and they drop these, like, test bombs, and it will literally shake the ground. It sounds like an atomic bomb. Like, it is ridiculous. Anyway, um... And my dogs get so scared. I know, babies. It's all right. <laughs> my dog's like, let me get up in your lap. Um, but anyway, so I calculate these items. So this is my estimated total that these items will cost me. As you can see, I'm under my budget. So I still have a little wiggle room. And like I mentioned, the this total is not 100% accurate. It's just an estimate. It just kind of keeps me mindful of you know, about how much I'm going to spend. And I always take cash. As you can see, I have my cash right here. So that is how much money I will have on me when I go shopping. So I cannot overspend. So that is my grocery list. If you want to pause it right here, you can. Um, at the end of this video, I'm sorry. Yeah. At the end of this video, I'll have, you know, the grocery haul. I'll also show you a couple clips of me shopping and always check the description box in my grocery hauls because um, I always have like a dinner plan idea, lunch ideas, and like snacks and stuff like that. Just from what we're going to eat throughout the week. Like I said, we're a pretty basic family. We eat a lot of the same things over and over again, but it's just what works for us. So anyway, but yes, I'm just going to jump right into the next clips. And I hope you guys are enjoying. If you are, oh, please pause this video right now and give me a thumbs up so I know this is a type of video that you enjoy.
big eye. Mom, I can't wait to get a toy. Remember, guys. So we are in the car now, and I wanted to tell you guys what we spent. So the total was $121.04. I did really, really good sticking to this budget. Like I had mentioned, I had to get a lot of stuff that wasn't necessarily um, food for us. So I think I did a pretty good job. Um, I hope all the clips I took turned out okay. It's kind of one of those things where you don't want to accidentally film someone and then get upset. So I was trying really hard to make sure I didn't get anyone on film. And, um, but I did spend $121. I'm super happy with how much I spent. We have guys everything I got as soon as we get home. And I think real quick I'm going to run through and grab me a coffee. Okay, we are home. And I'm about to back in really quick. Oh my god, my father-in-law's dogs are headed this way. They're so cute. But oh. so annoying. Why? I like this thing to beep at me. Do, 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 do. Right there. It's probably as close as I can get. <laughs> now here comes Marley and Charlie. Coming to say hello. Oh, you guys. The worst part is here. I got to unload these groceries. Hi, boys. Hi, boys. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. Where's your daddy? Hi. Ooh, y'all stink. Boy, y'all need a bath. More. Some more lay. Marley. So I just got back from the grocery store. I just got everything laid out and as organized as I possibly can real quick. Um, real fast, I'm just going to run through everything and show you guys what I got. So we'll start back here in the back. We got two pizzas for dinner one night, pancake mix, 
some goldfish for a snack, a bunch of ramen noodles. My husband loves those. Some uh, um, bow tie noodles to go with the chicken alfredo. Some lunch meat, milk, orange juice, eggs, butter, an onion, and some mushrooms to go with our steak tonight. We got some mixed vegetables and some green beans. Some um, cream of mushroom soup. I use this for my chicken and rice bake. Um, we got some dog food, some bread, some fresh broccoli, three avocados, some um, wild berry muffins, some banana nut muffins. We got some carrots, some rice, two different boxes. This is the rice I use for my chicken and rice bake. Um, some flour tortillas, some pickles. My husband loves those. Um, some toothbrushes, toothpaste, diapers, wipes. Two packs of toilet paper. These are just the cheap kind. They're 60 cent. I just buy a pack for each of the bathrooms. Um, uh, what are these called? Trash bags. Some Parmesan cheese for the chicken Alfredo. Some Velveeta cheese slices. Macaroni and cheese. Popcorn. We got some sausage that I'll use for breakfast. Um, I can also use that for the sausage burritos. Some hamburger meat, which is going to be for the meatloaf. This is the chicken breast. There's two dinners here. Um, I'll separate this. One will be for the um, chicken alfredo, and then one will just be for the chicken and rice bake. We have our steak right here. Um, some paper plates. That was not on my list, and I went ahead and picked that up. Then we got some laundry soap, some dish soap, some coffee creamer, some cereal. I don't think I mentioned the bananas yet, but that is it. That is the entire haul. I'm out of breath because I just carried all of this stuff inside by myself with the help of my kids. That kind of help. <laughs> they were like throwing everything on top of the um, table for me, trying to help me out. So, But yeah, don't forget to check the description box because I will have all of the meal plan um, down there in the description. I'll also have like the lunch ideas, the breakfast ideas. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up if you did. Hit that subscribe button if you're new. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye y'all.